my sister called me the first day that they knew they were having this, the horse seizure and said, I really need some help. And so at least a dozen people you know, show up and will just do anything that we ask, anything from helping me with the horses, picking up manure and cleaning stalls. and. One fellow from Maryland brought in 13 round bales of hay. No place is as caring as is given as what Berkeley County is. And it, I think this is true for the state of West Virginia. It is a marvelous place for people to look out for others, not only their fellow humans, but also animals. The sheriff's office got a report that some horses were malnourished. They got in touch with animal control. Animal control went out to see the horses and in fact did find that they were several, several horses were malnourished and in fact one or two horses had died. Uh, so they immediately took action and uh, confiscated the uh, horses and brought the horses into a, a small farm which the county has leased. Absolutely. This place has um, changed dramatically versus we started from scratch not having the things that we needed to supply them with normal health and fitness. That stuff would have to be purchased. Um, we asked for donations from the community and the community stepped up graciously. Once one person found out, it seemed another 10 people found out because everybody was telling everybody. So one person would come and give donations and then the next person would come with donations. I cannot tell you how many people, our phones never stopped ringing. You know, we've, we've set it up as a hospital. It's been very, very long hours. It's a heavy uh, workload, but ne not a single time did I not have somebody asking me, what can I do, what can I do? They've had a lot of people come just to, you know, bring the horses down and, and groom them, give them a little bit of TLC, and the trustees from the jail came out and they built the, the, the fencing um, to do a couple small paddocks. It was really never intended to have you know, 52 horses on it. For this little girl, she was probably, I don't know, 11 or 12. Um, parents had been out or sometime during the week and had picked out this uh, a two-year-old horse and had decided to adopt it for her. But she didn't know that, it was a surprise. So we brought the horse out and they suggested what horse should be brought out. And she's like, oh yeah, that's the one I wanted to see. That's the one I wanted. And so then her parents told her that it was going to be her horse. And she was just, you know, obviously she went ballistic. She was just wonderful. The horse community is very tight knit and people in general will yeah, give their shirt off the, their back to help a horse. It's, it's amazing. 52 horses and two cows were basically adopted in one week. Um, I think that's, I think that's really, really amazing.